The Hanford site is leading the way when it comes to developing technology to solve a highly complex problem in the nuclear cleanup world. U.S. Department of Energy contractor CH2M Hill Plateau Remediation Company is coming up with ways to retrieve highly radioactive material called sludge. We have a very difficult uh, problem. We're outside the normal range of engineering design for moving sludges. Richard Raymond, a project chief engineer for CH2M Hill, is part of the sludge treatment project team. They are the first in the DOE complex to come up with proven tools and processes to do this type of work safely and efficiently. This success is drawing other sites within the DOE complex that face similar cleanup challenges. Recently, Tennessee's Oak Ridge National Laboratory Transuranic Program visited the Hanford site to share lessons learned on the retrieval process. They visited a place called the Maintenance and Storage Facility, known as Massive. This is where tools and technology for the sludge retrieval process are engineered and tested. This large-scale mock-up is identical to the place where the work will actually happen. This allows workers to safely test tools, develop procedures, and train, all before they enter the highly radioactive facility to retrieve sludge. Raymond says the Oak Ridge team arrived to Hanford with a problem and left with potential solutions. Our pumping technology, very unique, and they're very interested in, in that technology. I would guess very highly likely that they're going to implement either that technology or something very similar to it. Nuclear sites like Hanford and Oak Ridge were once part of the Manhattan Project. Oak Ridge came to Hanford because both sites must clean up similar types of sludge. Raymond says CH2M Hill can help other projects succeed because of the highly skilled workforce we have. What we could share with them is a full-scale, fully functional prototype of our full process. And they were very interested. Currently, Hanford sludge is stored near the Columbia River, underwater, in an aging reactor fuel storage basin. The goal is to use this technology to remove, treat, and package sludge for interim storage and final disposition as remote-handled transuranic waste.